Hi. I know you're not going to believe this, but I'm not really Andy Rooney. I'm just pretending to be him. Have you ever wondered what goes on in a large advertising agency? Well, neither have I. But Tom Carey has invited me to take a look at one of the world's largest advertising agencies, the R.C. Macias Benton and Bowles. I'm not sure what Mr. Carey does with this agency. It has something to do with account management or accounting. I think that's it. I think he's an accountant. We're going to talk to someone later on that knows a lot more about what he does. Anyway, would you like to join me outside the building at 909 Third Avenue? That's DM B and B. At least they didn't call it B B D and M. I think that's a railroad or something. I suppose if you know anything about architecture, you can appreciate the simple beauty and elegance of this structure. Of course, I don't know anything about architecture, and I don't think the architect did either. To me, it looks more like a waffle iron. I'm told that this building also houses a post office. I wonder if that tells us something about the efficiency of this agency. This looks like a good place to start. You know, these people are the ones who are responsible for Mr. Whipple squeezing the Charmin. A real power idea. Excuse me. It's just that I'd like to, uh, uh ma'am, I, uh, maybe I'd be better off if I just poked around myself. And they say it's hard to get into advertising. This is an interesting floor, isn't it? Have you ever wondered about these light fixtures? They look pretty strange to me. I mean, they don't give off any kind of usable light. Perhaps they're trying to save money on pictures. This is a nice office, isn't it? Sort of reminds me of a suite at the Westwood Marquee. Nice furniture. Oh, look, there's awards on this table. I wonder whose office this is. Gee, no one's here working. You know, I haven't seen anyone working here all day. Have you ever wondered why you need an MBA to work here, but they don't feel you're educated enough to run the Xerox machine by yourself? DMB&B has some great commercials, but you know, I find some of them rather confusing. Take, for instance, that Bounce commercial, with all of those people jumping into their clothes. Well, nowadays, it seems that most people would rather be jumping out of their clothes. And what about Ann Page Jelly? I mean, do you really get a proud new feeling when you buy that product? And what about Dawn? getting grease out of your way. Tell me something. Has grease ever been in your way? I mean, it's never been in my way. Ever. Have you ever wondered who designed the floor plans for this agency? I mean, it seems that every floor is different. It sort of provides new challenges for the personnel. It kind of reminds me of a rat maze. <laughs> Which way is it to the cheese? Yeah, Aren't you Andy, Andy Rooney? Rooney? No, I'm not. I'm just pretending to be Andy Rooney. Oh, okay. Okay. They were nice, weren't they? I haven't had breakfast yet. Uh, may I have a piece of toast and a cup of coffee? No, I'm sorry. We're serving lunch now. Oh. Well, may I have a piece of toast and a cup of coffee for lunch? Sure. Would you like white or rye? Rye, please. Uh, I have an MBA in psychology. Aren't you Andy Rooney? <laughs> you know, everyone keeps asking me that question. Not really, no. As a matter of fact, I'm just pretending to be Andy Rooney. Isn't it odd? I'm really having a hard time finding someone that's working. You know, this is the media department. They tell me it's a very complex and analytical department. Over here is Rich Hamilton's office. Isn't that a great name? 
rich Hamilton. Sounds like a fullback for Notre Dame. Oh, not Excuse me, I, I didn't mean to interrupt. I bet you think I'm Andy Rooney. I'm not really Andy Rooney. I'm just pretending to be Andy Rooney. I'm sorry to bother you. Uh, do, you want, do you want to say hello to Morley? To Morley? Oh, that's classic. Come over here. <laughs> this is Morley Safer. A lot of people think I know him. I don't really. I think Andy Rooney knows him, but I'm just pretending to be Andy Rooney. This looks like an interesting office. Let's stop in here. You ever wonder whose uncle sold the agency these lamps? I mean, they're so ugly, only assistants get stuck with them. In fact, the more senior an assistant, the more of these ugly lamps they accumulate. This one seems ready to be CEO. I think they probably designed these lamps so that no one will steal them. You see them a lot in Florida, at retired executives' garage sales. Well, let's move on. wonder what the closed door button does on an elevator. I mean, I don't really think it has anything to do with closing the door. I press it all the time, but I always have the feeling that the door was going to close anyway. Anyway, I've enjoyed my visit to dmb and it's a very interesting place, and I learned a lot about the people that make it work. It seems to me that an advertising agency, just like about any company, is only as good as the people. I know that sounds a little trite and a little sappy, but they paid me a lot of money to say it. Good night.